Hello, I am Ashok Sonalkar and today we will see the joy of this centrifuge. This is a simple apparatus which you can make it at home. This is a large pulley and a small pulley. When you rotate this, this thing rotates. And let's see what happens now. Now you will see that this pulley is driving this pulley through this rubber band. This pulley being larger, it rotates this at much higher speed when I turn this handle. And these two small weights are attached to this arm which is on the same shaft. So let's see now what happens. If the body is moving in this direction and it starts moving like this in a circle, we say the centrifugal force acts away from the center. So let's say this is the centrifugal force. In that case, if this is the initial velocity of the body and the force is acting in this direction, it should start moving in a circle like this and not like this. Why is this? The real explanation is like this. This is the initial velocity of the body and this is the centripetal force which acts on the body and therefore this initial velocity goes on changing towards the center and it is the centripetal force which causes this circular motion. Centrifugal force is the reaction exerted by the body on the string. Centrifugal force does not act on the body. Centrifugal force acts on the string. Therefore, centrifugal force and centripetal force are two forces equal and opposite but not acting on the same body. Therefore, they cannot be in equilibrium. Coming to our model, these strings, this string is pulling the weight towards the center and that is why the weight is going round. Whereas weight is uh, acting, exerting a reaction to this and that is why the weights are trying to fly out. Thank you very much.